So now that we have finished solving for the dividends, the stock yield ratio, the dividend per shares in stocks, let's go ahead and proceed with bonds. So as I have said before, bonds, bond is an interest-bearing security which promises to pay a stated amount of money on the maturity date and regular interest payments. So in bonds, you can find security. So you, are, you know that you invest on a secured money. So investors purchase bonds issued by companies to fund their expenses in expansion, projects, improvements, etc. So investors who purchase bonds are essentially lenders to the issuer. However, the investors should be compensated for lending their money. Aside from being paid the loan at the end of a fixed amount of time, the investors also receive payments, usually every six months. So the terms that you should understand are the coupon or coupon, the coupon rate, The price of a bond, the par value, it's called par value in stocks, but it's called face value in bonds. And the fair price of bond. So it's all found in the definition of terms in your modules, so please check them out. So we have this exercise, determine the amount of semi-annual coupon paid for a 2.75% bond with a face value of 75 pesos, which matures after 10 years. Let us first write the given values. We have a face value of 75,000 pesos and a, a coupon rate of 2.75%. Note that the coupon rate and the interest rate is different from each other. So for this kind of problems, we use the formula of the semi-annual semi -annual coupon amount amount given uh, semi-annual coupon amount equal to F times the coupon rate R divided by 2. So F here is the face value and let's plug the values in. We have 75,000 times the coupon rate 2.75. I mean, this is... 0 0.0275 over 2. So this 2 here is because we have semi annual as our time frame. So semi annual, we have if we have annual, we have it m equal to. Uh, if it's annual, we have 1. If it's monthly, we have 12. We have 12. If it's quarterly, we have 4. And if it's semi-annual, we use 2. So in the problem, we're looking for the semi-annual. So that's why the formula is F times R, the coupon rate, divided by 2. So we have this as 1,000, 0, 
1031.25 pesos. So the semi annual coupon amount is 1031 pesos. So we have another exercise that determine the amount of semi annual coupon paid for a 4% bond with a face value of 200,000 pesos which matures after 10 years. How much and how many coupons are paid? So, again, we write the given values first. have given a face value face value of 200,000 if coupon rate of 4% Actually, we can solve the uh, semi-annual coupon with only this given, but there's another question, how many coupons are paid? So we have a uh, years, of, years of payment uh, maturity. Years maturity, we have T equals to 10 years. And our M here is because it's semi-annual, we have two. So we first find the semi-annual coupon amount. We have F times R, the coupon rate divided by 2. We have 200,000 times 0 0.04 divided by 2. Let your car cal calculus do the work. We have mm, 4,000 pesos. So the f the answer for how much is four thousand, and the answer for how many is our number of payments, which is in ten years there are in m times t. We have two times ten. We have twenty payments. That's it. Thus, each semi-annual coupon is 4,000 peso, 4, pesos paid 20 times every six months.